Bayern München are out of the oh, oh. German Cup, Jules. Oh, they let oh. a 1-0 lead over third division Saarbrücken, uh, which, let's face it, Saarbrücken is nearly in France. That's why I yeah, knew about it. on the border. Uh, so I'll let you handle how on God's green earth this could have happened. Wow. So I think that uh, just the... Uh, the silver, li silver, silver lining? Sil yeah, silver lining. Silver lining for Bayern. The last time they lost to a third division team in the Pokal, they won the treble. So, well, not in the same season because that would be impossible no, if they the, lost them. No, I know, but like, you know, the... The following year they won the treble? The Champions League, the league, and the Super... super yeah, that's not the treble, that's the nonsense no, but treble. Still, so, you know. yeah, they won the double. So they were not, they were not bad. Right. However, this was bad because it was a good team. You had Manuel Neuer in goal, you had Kim De Ligt, you had... De Ligt did get injured. Yeah, he got injured, okay, and came off. But you still had Thomas Muller, you had uh, Joshua Kimmich, you had Matisse Tell, you, you had, had... Alfonso Davies. So this is not like a Newcastle City. Man on yeah, yeah, with only kids from the academy. They take the lead and then they literally stop playing. Take it for granted. Kim try a stupid pass. They got caught. They lose the ball just before the, just before the break. They concede a goal. And then in the second half, they do have a lot of shots, not chances, shots on the edge of the box. Good, good position for a Musiala who came on, for Coman who came on, for Zane who came on, that kind of stuff. But no clear chances either. And guess what? On the counter, 96 minute, Saarbrücken scored the winning goal against Bayern in the. In the it's pretty unbelievable stuff. Sane actually, it is. Sane actually started the game. It was, it was, it was uh, Coman. Yeah, sorry, yeah. Uh, and um, and the Musiala who came on. But I want to ask you, um, who did not come on? Harry Kane. I, I'm just wondering, at 1-1, one, one, why not 100%. send him on? It just seems but I was like convinced that at some point I would see his number. He was on there the on bench. the bench. Could see him. Right. I think he even went to warm-up. So you lost, the super, you lost the German Super Cup against Leipzig. You got demolished, right? So yeah. that's one trophy out. In the, in the Pokal, which, okay, Leipzig have won the last two, but usually... Historically, Bayern do well in, and right. rightly so, because they have the, the biggest squad in the world, usually, which they don't, they don't have this season. You get knocked out again. <laughs> wow. Okay. I, I, think, I think Tommy T was trying to do a psychological thing. You got yeah, us into no, this mess. You get us out of it to the players who are starting. Let me challenge you to go yeah, and show no. them. Yeah, but, but no. No, it didn't work. I'll tell you no, what. He's been in charge 27 games. Uh, in his first 27 games, his record is considerably worse than... Uh, Julian Nagelsmann in Julian Nagelsmann's oh. last 27 games, wow. right? So the ones which let a good sack. Yeah. I, not the good one. Yet. I don't think Nagelsmann was the problem, and I don't. And Thomas Tuchel isn't the problem, or isn't solely the issue yeah, now. Yeah. There are deeper issues uh, in this team. Borussia Dortmund, on the other hand, gets past Offenheim 1 0 thanks to a goal from Marco Reus, Gab. They host none other than Bayern at the weekend. The when classic. It, when it rains, it pours, oh, doesn't yeah. it, potentially? Look, we've seen Bayern in this situation so many times. They're up against the wall, and then they and pull it out. They win five um, I'll tell you what, if they don't, and Borussia Dortmund, other than last week, Borussia Dortmund look a lot more solid. Yeah. This does not look like the old Borussia Dortmund. Uh, big question mark what this team is like without Emery Sean. We'll, we'll, we'll see. I, I don't think he's back. Uh, but um, I'll be tuning into that one. That's going to be absolutely That's gonna be huge. Correct. And guess what? It's not going to affect the top spot, which is also fun about Bundesliga this year.